Hi everyone, how are you? Hope you're enjoying your Labor Day weekend so far. And I am back to do a haul video. I actually have a lot of haul videos to do, catch up on and share with you all. I'll try to do at least one a day uh, this weekend and share with you guys what I got. And this is actually a long overdue Daiso and Ichiban Tan haul. I'm gonna see how it goes. If it's too long, I might have to do one separate one for Daiso and one separate for Ichiban Tan and uh, do it in two parts. But this is actually, I'm putting this as my September Daiso haul, but really it was part of like late July and um, throughout the month of August. So it is a collective haul. Um, got a lot of stuff and probably will do one either at the end of the month or October to uh, do maybe a Halloween one because I'm sure they will start having some Halloween stuff soon. But uh, this haul uh, consists mainly of a lot of stationery, crafts, housewares, a little bit of uh, beauty items. So some of this and some of that. So let's get started because we have a lot to share with you guys. Um, in terms of the stationery and craft section, um, I got this colored under mat for cutting works. So I thought this would be make a great cutting board and I love how it has the lines here for me to uh, cut and measure. And it's not too big. I really don't need one that big, but it's great for the cutting board. And to go with that, I got one of these design knives. And I hope they work well like those exacto knives. I don't know how well it's going to work. But I went ahead and got those for my projects. And then I thought this was kind of neat. This is... Uh, kind of like a magic eraser trick. So I thought it was super cute. So these are actually erasers that are shaped like a playing card. And there's this uh, kind of like a little tray here. And it's all in Japanese, it looks like, but uh, they also have some English translation. But the way you place it, I think you stick it here and then you put it in and then when you pull it out, kind of like disappear. So I think it depends on which layer you pull out. So you can play magic tricks with it. I just thought it's fun and cute. So I went ahead and got that. And um, I really liked this stapler, like I need any more staplers, but this is different because you can actually turn it so that uh, you can staple from different angles. So you see how you can pull it and turn flip it around so you can staple like round objects at that side you can staple like edges of uh, boxes and at different um, angles so I thought this stapler if it does work I it would be awesome because you can staple at different angles so I went ahead and got this to give it a try so that was new at my store um, got some gift wrap uh, I like these for not only gift wrapping uh, for you know gifts but also for different projects I know a lot of people have done some back to school DIY videos where I mean just using wrapping paper or craft paper you can slice up like any notebooks any journal covers and I picked these designs look how pretty this is very shabby chic with these floral prints comes in a pack of three rolls I know quantity wise it's probably not a lot but um, very very cute designs and then this one kind of has some flowers on it and I love the different colors and the stripes on it it also comes in three in a pack and again everything at Daiso is a dollar fifty unless otherwise marked and uh, the Daiso that I went to they actually have this new line it's called craft decor and they started carrying some of this merchandise I don't think it's the Daiso products but um, Daiso is now carrying this brand and these are the chalk markers so they remind me a, a lot of the ones I found at Dollar Tree they had different colors but I went ahead and got the orange and the green just because uh, Dollar Tree did not have it so now I have all the colors from the Dollar Tree and then I got the orange Orange and green so I have several colors of the chalk markers and I really want to compare if these ones work better or the ones at Dollar Tree work better if these ones work better I'm gonna go ahead and get more colors um, it's a dollar fifty so more than the ones at uh, Dollar Tree but these might be better quality so I got one of each of those colors um, from the same line. They also had some other kind of chalkboard crafty related items. This is a chalkboard masking tape. Look how thick that roll is for $1.50 it's not bad at all but it's basically the chalkboard material so how cute would it be to write my own like labels or just to put in my journals or projects how fun would this be so I went ahead and got that and also on the line they had a bunch of other chalkboard 
uh, related items. This is a chalkboard table sign. So it's really cute. You can put pictures or little messages on it. And then these are um, stickers. They do have the sticky on the back and they're like wooden embellishments. So they're not like the paper material, but they're like a, kind of like a um, wood material. So it's really cute. These are like the speech bubbles. And then these come in different fun shapes. So um, my store this past month got this line in, so I've never seen them before. And they also had some new washi tapes. And they're kind of in like the, I guess they call it the ABC masking tape. And this one, it's actually really cute. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's actually the alphabet. But each of the letters or almost all the letters has like an animal on it. Like, for example, you see the C, there's the cat there. And then uh, for... The F, you, I think you see the little fins for a fish. W, you see a whale there. And then Z has the zebra. So I thought this was a really, really fun roll of tape. And then this one right here, also kind of like the chalk-like motif. And it has like the hello, okay. So different sayings on them. I thought this was really cute. So these were the new line, um, I think, uh, the previous month I showed you guys kind of like the Paris ones and uh, tea related ones so this month they had these ABC ones that were new um, in the store okay couple of other craft stationery related items I got this letter set that I thought was so cute um, they didn't have very many left um, but I did find the last two and I got a set for on Nicole for friend mail um, but these are really cute they are the letter paper sets with the panda on them um, the other letter set that I got was this one which is kind of like a circus theme I love the elephant and the penguin how fun this one comes with the stickers the envelopes and the um, and the letter head so they're, it's super cute it's kind of the circus theme I really like the banners and the very pretty colors and then I got uh, some craft related items here are some paper flowers Great for DIYs and projects. $1.50, not bad. I love the colors of those. There's nine in each pack. Like I need any more duct tape, I got this roll of duct tape. I have the other colors. I don't think I have this one yet with the pink and the uh, and the blue polka dots. So they call it Design OPP Tape. I'm not sure why they call it that, but they call it OPP Tape Dot. So it's not a very thick roll, but I love the pastel-like colors. And then I needed some glue, so I got this one, this glue. It's uh, it's supposed to be quick dry and uh, very strong, I think. Because this actually is Chinese words, I think, if I'm reading it correctly. But it's supposed to be, kind of work like super glue. So I'm going to give this a try. I needed some glue. And then I got these pretty um, bows and hearts. Handicraft decoration they call it. I just love the bow. It reminds me of Hello Kitty. And then it comes with the ribbon at the bottom. And then a couple more stationary items. This was new in my store. This is a, they call it an accordion type scrapbook. So I thought this was really cute, very shabby chic. I love the closure right there. Let me see if I can go ahead and open it for you. But I thought this was really unique. I haven't seen it before in the store. So this actually just arrived at the store. But I thought it would be great for um, scrapbooking and uh, putting some fun memories there. So let me go ahead and open it. I love this part. Love any journals and notebooks. So look at the pretty mint green and white polka dot. And then it opens like this, kind of like an accordion file like that. So you could make it a memory book, scrapbook. I just thought it is so cute. I love it. Love it. And I think the last stationary item that I got was this uh, pencil holder. You could use it for pens, pencils, makeup brushes. I just love the romantic design on it. So you guys can see it. Hopefully you guys can see it okay. I got the bins that match with it in my last haul. So I just had to get the holder too. They had it in pink, but I went ahead and got this one because it matches with the bins. Okay, some other fun finds, you guys. Look at this lucky solar cat. 
Isn't it so cute? So we've picked up a lot of solar dolls from Dollar Tree. I've kind of slowed down on them. I don't get all of them. I only get the ones I really, really like. Um, I don't care too much about the um, Thanksgiving ones or, you know, any of the Halloween's ones. But this I could put all year long and it's Lucky, right? A Lucky cat. So it's a Jap Japanese cat. I picked one up at Ichiban Khan about a year or two ago. So I thought this would go cute with it. See? And they only had one white one left. One of the Daisos didn't even have any. But uh, when I saw them at the other store, they only had one white one left. And then the rest of them were like the black colored ones. But I thought the white one, the features are clearer. So it's, it's it's a bit nicer. So I went ahead and got that one. was really excited with that. Okay, a couple of uh, beauty related items and uh, accessories. I needed some uh, sharpeners, so I got, I went ahead and got this pack of two sharpeners for my uh, eyeliner pencils, and they actually work quite well. I mean, if you use regular sharpeners that are used for regular pencils and not makeup pencils, they just do not sharpen well. These sharpen really well, and uh, I needed a new pack, so I went ahead and got those. So $1.50 for two of them, not bad at all. Um, I desperately needed some makeup Makeup wipes. I thought I still had some makeup wipes and then realized I used them all. And so when I went to the Daiso, all they had was this one. Um, it comes in a pack of 30. Honestly, not my favorite. Uh, my favorite one is the one in the kind of like foil wrap and grapefruit scent. Um, these are definitely my last choice. I don't think I'm going to repurchase this. I actually bought two boxes because I really needed it. But the sheets are so small. It's like a strip rather than a, a whole piece of wipe so I definitely wouldn't purchase this again and definitely it'll be my last choice if I really needed uh, makeup wipes I was a bit disappointed with this um, buy it's definitely one of the worst makeup wipes at Daiso I would definitely not get that again um, I wanted to try these masks these face masks this is the green tea essence mask and I believe these are more like Korean than Japanese because the writing I think is Korean and Korean cosmetics um gosh I need to show you guys my uh Korean uh and online beauty haul but they come up with some of the most innovative beauty products and I, I just love some of the Korean makeup brands and when I saw these masks at Daiso I really wanted to give them a try I went ahead and picked one up in the green tea and one in the cucumber mask it's so important to take care of our skin, right? So I went ahead and uh, got those. And then I got this. This is a set of two hand creams. And you guys know how much I love cr hand creams. I carry it in my bag every day, use it multiple times a day. And I love the creams at Daiso. Their packaging is so pretty. But I thought this was so cute. It's like two... Um, for the price of $150, and it comes with this carrying case that has these flower prints on it as well. This one is in the Blooming Jasmine scent, and this one is in the Wild Honeysuckle scent. I just thought it was so cute, so I went ahead and got a set of that since I always need uh, the hand creams. And then this is, I guess it's supposed to make your skin smooth. I think the surface of it, you're supposed to rub it along like your feet, kind of like a pumice. I think it's like a pumice. Um zone in a way and I think it's supposed to keep the hands and the feet smooth so I'm going to give this a try I've never tried this before especially from the Daiso brand so I'm curious to see how that would work and then um, the last item kind of in the you know health and beauty is this tube squeezer I don't know about you guys definitely in my family we really squeeze the toothpaste all the way to the top and we go from bottom to top we squeeze it from bottom to top we're kind of anal in that way you know we hate anyone who squeezes it in the middle of the tube we start from bottom and push it up so i thought this would be useful in the bathroom it's the tube squeezer to keep it clean and keep it uh so that it rolls up as we go so i got that and then uh on to some of the kitchen items. I got these two sets of the forks. They're the jewelry forks and they are so cute, you guys. I don't know if the color is gonna come up at all, but one of them is supposed to be pink and one of them is supposed to be blue. This is the blue set and this is the pink set with the little crystal on the top and they're the miniature forks. How cute. I definitely wanna have a tea party with all my cute cups and utensils and desserts that I have. So I thought these would be great to use they are so adorable 
and then I needed some big chopsticks for cooking and they have these big white bamboo chopsticks and this is in the marine design and by marine that means it has anchors on them they have so many designs but I really like this one with the stripes and the anchors they had some that were more floral pattern but I needed these these are great for cooking noodles when I make like instant noodles or any dishes that require a big chopstick so I got those it comes in a pack of four four big chopsticks for a dollar fifty not bad at all okay some of the other items we're almost done with the Daiso portion I think I'm gonna do a separate video for Ichiban Khan um, but I got this fluffy keychain look how cute this is so I thought this would be cute uh, to add to you know any handbags or uh, bags to carry around it just, I just thought it was really cute this little fluffy thing fluffy keychain okay a couple of things for like my uh, bathroom and for cleaning I got this fluffy handy mop right here and there's a holder so the mop comes out like this okay I think I'm gonna keep it in my car so you could keep it clean by putting it in this bin it has the handle there very cute they even make their cleaning products cute and then I needed some new like clothes pins and so I got this set right here these are really cute these have like the flower prints on them it comes in a pack of 10 and they seem pretty sturdy so I went ahead and got that and then I got this this is the laundry net. I love these because these are great for the lawn, uh, for the, um, when you put it in the washing machine, it keeps your, it protects your clothes. So any um, ones that have the very nice material, you don't want to rip or get tangled with other clothing. It basically protects the garments. So I got that and it's shaped kind of like a, a football shape. <laughs> Doesn't it look like it? And then uh, it opens like that. You see how it kind of folds up and then the zippers right here to put it in. I needed that. And then um, this is a scrubbing board. And you see how it has this surface here. And it, they use it for cleaning, but this is great to clean up makeup brushes, actually. That's what I was thinking of doing. So I went ahead and got that. And then I got this. This would be, I want to see if it's going to work, but it's supposed to be a drying agent for shoes. And you guys know, in the summer, we sweat, right? We definitely sweat. And these would at least keep the shoes clean and not smelly. So I wanted to give these a try and see if it works. If it works, I'm going to pick up more. So I got that. And then the last two items, I picked up some bags. I loved those bags. The first is a mini one that's kind of like a fabric material. I love this bow. And it comes with the navy and white polka dot pattern. It's super cute. So this would make a great uh, like mini purse or wallet if uh, I don't want to take my whole purse or my big wallet with me and just want to put like my ID and some change in there. It's really cute. And then this is great for traveling. It looks kind of like a leather material and that's what I like about it. Very simple but classy looking and of course I love the gold zipper here and you know they kind of go together kind of like the white and navy material and they were all a dollar fifty as well. So this was my Daiso portion of my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, see some goodies that uh, you can find at your Daiso. I can't wait to watch everyone's Daiso hauls as well and uh, we'll be back soon in a couple of weeks uh, when they have some new Halloween stuff and some new products. I definitely like to share it with you all. So please stay tuned for my next portion of the haul which will be the Ichiban Kan haul and I'll talk to you all soon and hope you enjoy. Have a good night. Bye-bye.